How's everybody doing tonight? I'm Donnie. I'm Ryan. Tonight we've got a special indoor investigation of a 1912 hotel saloon. The room we're in tonight is actually where a poker game went on. And the guy lost his hotel and saloon in a poker game. And by what we researched, it said that the guy kind of flipped out, got mad, and the guy that won the motel, or hotel and saloon, actually shot and killed the previous owner of it, which is just stuff that we researched. But tonight we decided to come in this room and start out our night, and I uh, think that we should uh, get in a poker game. See if we can't communicate with the poker players. But we got our REM pod set up, our K2 set up, but the K2 is actually in this room that's already on high. So if you want to communicate with the K2, we ask that you take it up the red, the red uh, dot so we can actually see it. We got Ryan's EMF meter set up. We got the ovulus, so I'll go ahead and turn that on. We are going to be recording this session, so if you want to speak to us, you can come and speak in the digital recorder. This is EVP session one. My name is Donnie. I'm Ryan. If you want to speak to us, you can come and speak into any piece of equipment up on this table. Like I said, we are going to be playing a game of poker up here with you guys. Uh, we can either make friendly wagers, or if you'd like to put your motel up for a wager, we'll gladly accept. If you, you want to put the sign of deed and stuff laid on the table, you can. And it just popped up. Said Bible. <laughs> Alrighty. But anyways, like I said, we got the rim pot. All I gotta do is come up, get near it, and it sound off. Or if that champagne, gotta go nuts. K2 just come up and touch it. Just move the light up to the red for us. Speak to the ovulus. You come up and mess with the. EMF, we're trying to be reading or watching that. Uh, we do got the deck of cards. Who wants to play some poker up in here? Me, me. That just popped up life. Lost his life playing poker. Alright. So, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, we don't have a dealer here tonight. I'll be the dealer. Uh, pretty much gonna play by your house rules. No lying, cheating. Uh, no getting pissed off if you lose. What well, I researched is that it was a three person game. So we'll play with three people. Now just so the TV viewers know what we're doing, we ain't actually playing poker. Uh, we're using it for a trigger object. Maybe a person that lost his hotel and saloon will come up and join us. Maybe we can catch him on camera or catch his voice or maybe he'll collect equipment for us, but So, uh, the Oculus just said summer. Which, the research I did, he actually lost his saloon and hotel in the summer. A 75. Hmm. Now, if that was you, can you go touch one of the devices again and let us know that it was summertime when he lost this place? Maybe 
He's setting up to the chair. Ready to play. Alright. Well, we go ask you, just go ahead and put your wager in. What do you want to wager here? If you want to wager your uh, hotel and saloon, can you touch one of our devices? Can you tell us your name? Sorry, I didn't mean to cheat you a card. Let's see if that helped me at all. still here. I think my hand's pretty good. I'm willing to make a big bet. Can you tell us the hand that beat you to win the hotel? trying to bluff him or something and lost.
What did he wager that you would have won had you won? Did they drain you dry? It's your turn to act. What do you want to do? Do you want to fold? Do you want to bet? Do you want more cards? If you want to hit. Or whatever. Yeah, say if you're going to hit. You want to touch one of our devices and make it go off. Pass. Come up and make one of them go off. If you want to bet, come up and make one of the devices go off. Session number two. Uh, right, gonna kill that one. So we're gonna get back. Uh, to our poker game. Uh, the funny thing was when we just took a little break. I. We just interviewed a guy that gave us more history of this building and stuff. And after he got up, we shook hands and he left. And I took a drink of water, and then all of a sudden, all of this popped up water. But if you're still here, can you make one of our devices go off again to let us know that you're still here? teacher maybe he thinks he's going to teach us a thing or huh? okay. guess that means he's in and you're all in huh all right let's get this game started So 
Were you a teacher? Is that what you're telling us? One more. Go ahead and place your bet. Take three cards. I'm also going to take three. Or are you going to stay with what you have? It's up to you, buddy. If you're all in, go ahead and give us some noise. Or if you're folding, give us a line or a number or a word. You must change. So you want some cars?
slide the cards on over that you don't want. We're gonna keep the cards, light up one of our devices here, and let's show each other what we got. See who won. If you got a pretty good hammer and you want to put the deed down to your hotel and saloon, light something up and let us know. Both of us are all in already. Burn. Technically, he lit something up. Alright. Alright. Who's going first? Here, go first. If you want me to flip your cards over, can you light something up or speak to us? Outside. Outside. I said speak to us. Yeah. All right, friend, I'll flip the cards over. Now, this is for your hotel, correct? If this is the deed to your hotel, light something up. Or you can even speak to us again. Once again, we just like the letter key viewers know we gotta let the spirit actually have time to draw energy to actually communicate through one of these things. So there's a speed. Let's see what he has. This is for the Deed Deer Hotel and Saloon. The only thing he has is a pair of twos. Alright, you next. What do you got? Me? The only thing I got is a pair of threes. Man, so far you're winning. However, I have a pair of tens. Folks, I am now the proud owner of Spawn Establishment. Why did you upset when you lost your hotel in a poker game? If so, can you light something up for us or tell us into the digital recorder? Alright. Well, we thank you for playing the game with us. I mean, sorry about your luck, sorry about losing. But it's a poker game, deal's a deal. Ryan's walking away with the money and the deed to your hotel and saloon. No hard feelings for me. None for me. Alright, folks. Uh, we're going to go ahead and take a pause really quick and we're going to. Move on to the next room. Uh, quite the interesting room. 
next room we're going into is actually a room that it's number number four, but the room actually had a dark history to it. Uh, there was a guy that killed his family and then committed suicide inside this next room we're going into. So we're going to go in there and try to communicate to him, with him to see why he did what he did. And so we'll be, be right back. Why don't we go get set, set up over there. Alright, we're back in room number four now. This room that we told you that the guy killed his family and then hung himself in here. So uh, we're going to begin EVP session number three for tonight. If you're in this room with us, or if anybody's in this room with us, you, we got these devices set up, you can come in and speak into the black box here. Or you can use the K2 and light it up. We ask that you go past the green and try to get it as high as you can. Or all you gotta do is just come up and touch this. The closer you get to it. So the closer you get to it, it's gonna sound like that. The more, it's gonna go like that. Alright, once again, my name is Donnie. And I'm right. If there's anybody in this room with us, can you come and touch one of our devices or speak in a recorder or speak through the Oculus to us? Or we got this EMF set up, you can come and touch it to make it rise up and stuff, and Ryan will be watching that. Can you tell us if you're male? Can you tell us if you're female? Alright. Pennies that word. From being a 1912 building, being a western town, it just popped up boot. So maybe Later on tonight, you can actually hear boots walking upstairs or coming down the hallway or something. So I'll take that word as being in this location. What about you? Yeah. Can you tell us your name? Can you tell us how old you are? If you don't want to use one of these devices, can you make some kind of noise inside of this room? That would work nice coming only from this room, not from outside or out the door or nothing. Make a noise exactly in this room for us that we can hear. Are you female? Uh, 
Is there more than one of you here? Think about that third word bottle. Were you actually hitting a bottle when you did what you did up in this room? If so, can you light something up? Who's Carol? Is there a Carol here with us? Did uh, all this take place in the spring? If so, can you light something up for us? Or tell us another recorder? Are we sitting right below, right where you hung yourself? Are you a kid? Yeah, 
Once again, it does take a little time for the spirits to draw energy to actually start communicating. So, it's not like we're running out of stuff to ask, it's we're waiting on them so they can actually start touching the stuff to make it go off. I got one. <clears throat> if you want us to leave you alone, and move on to another room. Light up all these devices or You don't have to be scared of us, we're just here to talk to you and learn more about you. Alright, we're back. We're in uh, room three now. Um, we didn't get told any of the happenings of this room, so we're going to experience on our own. This is EP session number four. If you're here with us in this room, we got devices set up. I got these come and touch one of them. Um, the round box with the antenna on it. Lights go off. I got these come up next to it. Or get up close to it. Do that. The very box just go up and touch it and make the lights go past green. Or you come speak in the Ollie list. Or in the digital recorder. And then the machine in front of Ryan actually give, it gives numbers and stuff. So if you go up touch it, it'll make the numbers rise. All right, so I'm gonna let Ryan start the ZVP session off. All right, my name is Ryan. I'm Donnie. And we're here just to communicate with you. And is there anybody here that would like to speak to us? If so, go ahead and like Tony said, speak into the mic, touch one of these devices. Are you a male? Are you a female? Are you an adult? Are you a child? Just popped up on the Oculus Rewind. So, are you an adult? So, you're an adult. Double confirmation.
just not self, that's another man from once walking upstairs. Uh, are you an adult male? If you're an adult male, can you light up the room pot again? Are you an adult female? thinking. Alright, take all the time you need. Is there more than one of you here? If you're still here with us, can you light, light something off? Do we know? All right, we're back. Uh, we took a little break. Um, now everyone's left the building. It's just me and Ryan inside this awesome place. This awesome three-story place. Uh, first off. Uh, I'd like to thank Aaron for letting us come in here all night long. Right, thank you. And such a good guy. I mean, he just got done feeding us dinner and he left. Said we had the whole building to ourselves to have fun. Um, we're actually in room six right now. We're gonna do a short EP session. Um, we got all these devices set up. If there's anybody in here, just come up and touch whatever one. Speak into the recorder. Use the audio list to speak to us. Ryan has his machine set up over there. If you can raise the number up on that. Alright, you ready to start this? Let's do this, man. Is there anybody here with us? If so. Come and give us a yes into the recorder or touch one of the machines and make it go off. If you are in here, you can now make some kind of noise that we can hear. Oh, we do got motion sensor set up out in the hallway that leads down the stairs and also to the back door. So if you pass one of them, you can make a chime go off. We'll know you're out there. Is the little girl still here with us?
just popped up wave. Are you waving at us? If you're a male, can you make one of these devices go off for us? Yes, we did travel a long ways to come here to visit with you. We're not here to ask you to leave. We're just here to get to know you. If you're female, can you come up and touch on these devices for us? a bit. <clears throat> Are you a gambling kind of person? If you're an adult, come touch on this piece of equipment for us, make it go off. Are you a child?
If you are here, can you finish this knock? Turned off. And it's not that bad, it's still on. But just to note, our actual EVP machine stopped recording. So now I'm going to restart it. I wonder when it stopped. Seven minutes. Alright, this is EP number 7. For some reason our tape recorder got shut off. If that was you, can you come turn it off again for us? I think I'm going to try that knock again. I think I shut off after the knock. Alright, try it again. Okay, so I'm going to do the knock again. Can you finish it for us? If you are in here, can you open up one of the doors? It's kind of getting warm up in here.